Ever wondered how to add that captivating scrolling text to your videos using CapCut on PC? Today, we've got a seasoned professional in the world of video editing, David, ready to guide you through the process step by step. Stick around as we unravel the secrets behind creating eye-catching scrolling text that will elevate your content to the next level. Let's dive in. Welcome, David here. So like you've known in this video, we are going to be, or oh, I will really be showing you how to do the scrolling text effect. As some of you know, it adds the running text effect in video. And we're going to be doing this with CapCut PC. Those are those texts that you see running from one side of your video to another. Trust me, I'm not going to waste your time. The three things you're going to learn is how to make the rolling text effect how to increase the speed or make it slower and how to add stickers so the first and the last will come first then how to make it fast will come at the end so let's get started the first thing we want to do is to bring in our text for this one i'm going to go to chat gpt already so we go on to default text you can use default text you can actually use some other text but for this i will just use this particular text and i will add it here as you can see when I'm going to click on it, so I'm going to bring it to my timeline like so. so. So we have it now, it's there for us to use. As you can see, it says default text. So we're going to just control A and I'm going to paste my text I want, control V. Okay, so I have my text already and this is the text I'm going to be working with. I can decide to change the font or the way it looks. Okay, it says font system. You can change the font, you can change it to whatever font you want, you can use this or use that. Let me just use this so that I don't waste your time on this video, so I'm just using elegant, okay? So this is the first step. The second step, you can leave it like this if you don't want any box to be beneath it, but for me, I like a box beneath it, why? Because this helps just in case you are putting it under a video with the same color background it's going to help isolate the text so that you can read it better so to do that we're just going to scroll down okay and find this border all right so let's find it okay, find the border we're going to be using stick with me this video is going to be really short it's not complicated at all okay Okay, where it says background let's click on background all right so we can add a background to it and put in a background color it is black here you can make that for instance let's make it blue okay okay we have that green that's not blue right so let's make it blue for instance, no, it's about Valentine. Once again, happy Valentine if you are watching this for the very first time. All right. I wish you all the best love you can find. It's going to be a good day and not just a good day, a good year in 2024 and a better year 2025, 26 and the years after. Okay, so this is a Valentine special if I'm just telling you that for the first time. Okay, so we have the text now as you can see. So now... It is time to make it scroll as you can see it's not scrolling yet so i'm just going to move to the beginning all right i'm just going to move to the beginning and then add the scrolling effect all right which is very important so i'm going to increase this edge why am i doing that so that by the time i get this out of the frame and do the effect you will be able to use it properly right so now that we have it like so the next thing you want to do is to just drag it okay oh sorry we'll find position you want to add keyframe to it right you want to add keyframe to it adjust the position and add keyframe so i'll just take this out of the screen like so okay and then i'll move this cursor to the beginning and then i'm going to add a position keyframe okay that will be a position keyframe 
and then I'll move it again. I'll move this play head to the end, like so. Let's put it somewhere here. And then I'm going to move this text like this till I move it completely to the end. I'll just move it to the end. Okay, perfect. So now if we play it from the beginning, like so, and we hit play from the beginning, this is what we should get. We should get it moving. As you can see, it's moving extremely fast. It's moving extremely fast so you can actually make this text longer so that it does not move too fast as you saw then we're going to click on this keyframe we added here and move this keyframe all the way okay so now if we go back and play it this is how to make it slower as you can see it's still very fast it's moving fast so we are going to make it really slow and we're going to play it again remember we need it to be really really slow not super fast like the way it is right about now so remember your words or whatever you put will determine if it's going to be fast or really slow all right so we can drag this to the end like so and play it again as you can see it's reducing so if we keep dragging this okay we keep dragging that out and moving this okay it will just you see it's getting better so that's how to change the speed that's how to change the speed you can drag it out as much as you want as you can see it's getting slower but it's still very fast so i'm just going to drag this out for as much as i can you get you get the the thing i'm trying to do here right you get what i'm trying to do so i'm going to pause it and just make it slow and get back so now you can see we've added the keyframe to the end it's about 48 seconds so now if i play it you see how Sorry, I'll play it now. And you see how it is. So you can see how good it's looking. Not complicated at all. And it's moving smoothly. So now let's add in. Let's add in. Uh, let's move it to the end. Like so. And then I'm going to go to stickers. Right. And I'm going to add the love at the beginning. Also. So this is trending. We're just going to find love. Okay, just find love. All right, we can use one of these or we use this. So I'll just download this one and bring that in. Okay, so I'm just going to bring that in now and I'm going to do the same thing. I did with with the sticker or with the scrolling text I'm just gonna do same thing with this one gonna reduce the scale I want it to be somewhere here and I'll just reduce the scale okay and I'll reduce the positioning to be somewhere here okay so now if I do that okay as you can see it's not moving now but it's just showing there so where the red cover covers it up I'm going to add the first position keyframe and then I'm going to drag this to the end of this okay as you can see i'm gonna drag this and make it this long and i'll try and click on this one to know where this keyframe is so that i can add this keyframe too and then i'll add a keyframe again 
a positional keyframe there all right so if i play that now if i play that from beginning we have that looking like so okay super interesting super easy to do all right super interesting if you also want if you also want it to move you can actually make it move like this or just leave it like this so i'm just gonna leave this the way it is i hope this video was interesting and it take you a lot of time thanks for watching i'll see you on the next one stay blessed